Ah, oh, I see. You found the Baja Blast Destiny. That can come in handy, Kirby. Bio, 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 bio. Ah, well, okay. Bio, 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 bio. Hmm, I don't know about that. I mean, yeah, but uh, uh, he's pretty smart. Bye, bye. Yeah. <sighs> All right. Uh, he really wants to get rid of Ludwig? Why? <sighs> Whatever. Uh, hello, matey. Yes, Foxy. What do you want to talk to me about? Well, he said that um, if we lose this challenge, we should vote out, um, I believe, Gaston. Why does he want to eliminate Gaston? I feel as though Squash would be better, or Night Zombie, or even that brat. Hey, the Cuphead Kid? Yes. He reminds me of the kids that used to bully me in school. <sighs> Every kid on this planet should be fat, but here he is, skinny. I was once like that. Oh, all right. I told Boris to watch over the ice cream factory while I was gone. <sighs> I hope he's doing a good job at it. But this foxy guy, I've developed a close relationship with him. He's a robot. I wonder if he'll want to join. Uh, how perfect. Hi, I'm not one to be overly nice to people. I don't believe kindness is needed, matey. I'm also not one to be overly trustworthy of people, but Rod, he seems very trustworthy. Hmm, I don't know about his past. I don't know what he's talking about. Kids used to bully him for being fat. I would like to know more about him. All contestants, please report to the challenge room in the plane. Aye. Hmm. I'll be going. Hello everyone and welcome back to Total Drama Plush Expedition Season 4. Last time, what did we see? We saw the princess of the Mushroom Kingdom, Princess Toadstool, head home after wanting to quit because she's not really a competitive person and she misses Funky and Mario. Which, I mean, is understandable from her. I mean, she's not even competitive. <sighs> Anyways... What will happen on this episode? I'm not sure. Find out once we roll the intro for like, I don't know, the 100th time. We. Hello, contestants! Man, I can't believe we just turned October. <sighs> How fast the year go by. You know, last year we were in Season 3, now we're on Season 4. I can't believe it. And hopefully Karina doesn't attack, but... Okay, are you guys ready to hear the destination today? I don't care. Shut up. If you're about to talk, I really don't care. We're going to the Chocolate Kingdom. <sighs> I, believe I think I know that place. Wasn't the Hershey Bar guy in Season 3? Yep. Ah, uh, you know, I'm not really a man to chocolate myself. Anybody got a chocolate bar? <sighs> oh, I know all about the chocolate kingdom. Well, uh, if you know so much about it, then who's the queen? Um, Princess Preach? Uh, that's the Mushroom Kingdom, Grinch. Oh. The 
Chocolate Kingdom. I've heard legends about it, but we're actually going there? Wow. I've done my research on it, and it's not as amazing as everyone says it is. It's a tiny castle with rusty floors, dirty rooms, and just chocolate. Me and my bro went there once, and it was not cool. Oh, really? Chocolate? A kingdom made of chocolate? That sounds silly to me. Why is it silly to you, Squash? I mean, it sounds pretty cool to me. And my non-biological cousin, Cuphead. What's up? Well, I think people should only be eating healthy food, like Squash. So you're a cannibal? Oh, frick. Let's get to our destination, then. Okay. We have made it to the Chocolate Kingdom, and time to reveal our special guest. Hello guys, do you like Reese's? Cause I do. The real Reese's guy? I've been wanting to beat you for my entire life, I love Reese's. You know, I've been trying to figure out if it's Reese's or Reese's for my entire life. Okay, I looked it up, I think it's Reese's. Well, I actually have a bag right here if you'd like some. I'm just kidding! I'm gonna be throwing them at you. Yep, the Reese's guy here. It's basically just gonna be like Reese's dodgeball. So you're, he's gonna throw his Reese's puffs, or not Reese's puffs, but just re regular Reese's at you, and you are gonna have to dodge them. If you catch it, then a member from your team comes back. Um, if you catch it when none of your team members have been eliminated yet, it, nothing happens. Let's say Grinch got eliminated on this team, and then everyone was like getting fired at by the Reese's, and Tails caught it. Grinch would come back, and Let's say Kirby and Grinch got eliminated and then Tails caught it. Either Grinch or Kirby would come back. So there's kind of a limit on how many players can come back, but we're just going to do it until there are only one. Um, well, the entire team has been decimated. Well, I guess we'll start. <laughs> well, I am a knight of a kingdom my own. The zombie kingdom, you could say. Duck the Zombus. So, I know my way around this place. <laughs> I've played my fair share of sports. This will be easy. We'll see about that. We're on the same team, Cuphead. Oh. Okay, let's start. <laughs> Who wants them? All right, let's start. Har, matey, 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 ah! I got the fox out. I've never seen magic like that before. I mean, Kirby hit him that time, but I'll still count it as him getting hit. So see, Cuphead. Well, I've only tried to take over Christmas in Whoville. I haven't really drawn anything like this before. Oh, God. A fellow green-haired person just died. Your voice is really annoying. <laughs> really? My voice is annoying? Would you rather have me talk like this? That's even worse! I guess I'm gonna talk like this for the rest of the video. <laughs> Level 25! Only a few more levels before I get to evolve into Incineroar! Oh god, I wonder how bad that's gonna be. <laughs> oh, oh, it's hot! It's hot! <laughs> <sighs> oh, Ludwig von Beethoven! <sighs> Who was a little pest that did that? <sighs> Ice cream man. Pathetic. <sighs> Squash is out of here. <sighs> Uh, uh, uh. Alright. Whoa! Uh. Got it! Yes! That means someone from our team comes back. Oh, oh. Well, Grinch is back. Yes. Oh, what's up, Grinch? Thank you for resurrecting me. Huh, chocolate, give me a break. Huh. Alright, someone from the cups is coming back. And who is it? Rod. Yo, he's back. Ah, that blue-haired... Get over here! Hmm? Oh, 
Rod Sullivan. <laughs> We're trying to put up a fight. <laughs> what? How did the spell not work? What? What are you? <sighs> you don't know who I am. You don't know who my father is. I don't really have a real father. Ludwig. I got my revenge. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to unfreeze him. <sighs> and so it's a battle, Rod. Bye 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 Beetlejuice, stop talking in that <sighs> annoying voice. Nah, I'm good. <sighs> e se parlo così? Hey, so now you're speaking Italian. <sighs> <sighs> Holy frick. <sighs> I'm the ghost with the most. <sighs> Oh my god! Uh, uh, okay, uh, um, well, um, uh. Oh my god, there's one coming at me! Gotta catch it! Gotta catch it! Gotta catch it! I knocked him out cold! <laughs> was Ludwig eliminated? Yes, he was. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> now, where did he go? Ah! <sighs> Again. We are now down to our final three. Two people for the cups, Gaston and Night Zombie, and one person for the geniuses. Where am I gonna throw it? Where am I gonna throw it? You! <laughs> yeah, I got it. Yar, arr, arr. <laughs> it's three to one, pussycat. This will be easy. My <laughs> sword always works. Well, hail Dr. Zomboss. Hey! Finally back, matey. Ah! Oh, well, Foxy just got eliminated right as he got back. Ay, my head. Arr! It's now down to Gaston and Litton. <sighs> Where is he? Where is he? Ugh. How about you go say hi to him? What the? Ah! Ugh. 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 Dang. Ugh. And just like that, Gaston has won for the cups. And the geniuses, you're up for elimination. Again. <laughs> no one hits like Gaston matches wits like Gaston. Okay, we didn't need the musical number, Gaston. Anyways, uh, let's go on the plane and voting will begin in two hours, so be prepared. You, my friend, have done well. <laughs> did you aim for who we are going for? Well, hopefully he did. Yes, I did. I aimed for Cuphead the entire time. I got him out second, and he didn't come back at all. So, I just played the game and kept my cool. Reese's Cup, you have done a good job. I am appointing you to be a knight. Really? Yes. <sighs> Hershey Kiss here, well, sh as you know, she was appointed as a knight so many years ago. But now, you are my second tonight. Stand here with me. Okay. And we'll see how Twizzler feels about this. <sighs> Hopefully the mugs in the cup come back here so we can get our revenge. Yes. <laughs> our revenge. Our revenge. They'll pay for the Malamars. All those Malamars that they ate, they will pay but lady chocolate twas are so annoying hush no one in this kingdom is annoying now go in the timeout corner here she kiss what uh, fine <laughs> just watch reese's hershey will come crawling back to us but we won't accept his apology he'll be off on his own <laughs> yeah now get to bed we're all going to sleep here. <sighs> all right.
So, your team's up for elimination once again. And you've been working with us for a while, so who are you thinking of eliminating? Bio, 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 bio. Haha, <laughs> I am happy you're right, you want to get rid of him. <laughs> He's annoying. Yes, but make sure to really think about your decision. Boyo, 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 boyo. So you're also in an alliance with Toro Cat. Boyo, boy, bye, 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 bye. Interesting. Yeah, matey. Well, <clears throat> let me know how the elimination goes, matey. Arr. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Yes, indeed. Bye, yo. Hello, geniuses. For a team being called geniuses, you guys did not do well in this challenge. The only one that actually ended up getting brought back was Grinch. But the rest of you, yeah, pretty bad. Uh, I did bad in the challenge again. I don't want to go home. Listen, kid, whatever happens, happens. The first one safe is Grinch. What? I want to be the first one safe. Just because you're the ghost with the most doesn't mean you could be safe, Beetlejuice. I'm safe. Oh, goody. The next one safe. Kirby. Bye. Toro Cat, you're also safe. You did amazing in this challenge. The only bad thing you did was failing, but even then it's Gaston, so I don't, I'm not surprised. Thanks. Next one safe. Beetlejuice. Ah, fantastic. The final two, Tails or Ludwig? Who's going home? Please, I did not compete on the show to be bested by a tiny fox. But, but aren't you also a kid? A kid smart for his age, that is. And while you're also fairly wise for your age considering the Sonic games, uh, you can be packing your bags, Tails. I don't want to go home. <laughs> Thank you, Beetlejuice. We just do the thing now. safe is Ludwig <laughs> thank you just kidding it's actually tails what wait uh, uh, wait uh, I'm safe yeah uh, uh, I'm safe yes what 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 yeah Ludwig you got the most votes you know, I'm kind of a lone wolf, blue-haired guy. I don't work with people. <laughs> and so I should have known. <sighs> and so this is how it ends. I get eliminated in episode 12, and I don't win. <laughs> oh, the fans will vote for me. Well, they won't. Doesn't matter. It isn't an earned victory or an earned defeat, you could say. Tail should have went home. In fact, no, that hairy fuzzball should have went home. Or even that green-haired exorcist should have gone home. I used my magic in the challenge to get Rod out, and while he came back, he still ended up getting out. Why would you vote for me if I did something good in the challenge? You two, well, you are idiots. Personally, I think you're the only idiot here, but whatever. I can't believe I actually beat him. But I wonder what Foxy and Rob were still talking about. I mean, they aren't, we weren't on our team, but they were still, like, talking as if, like, they were. Like, maybe they're... Could they be, like, in an alliance with someone that is on our team? Really? Oh, hi, Toro Cat. You're saying they're running an alliance with someone on our team? Mm-hmm. I've actually seen Kirby hang out with them a lot. Maybe he's in their alliance. Ha, <laughs> nah, Kirby's in my alliance. You believe Kirby's in your alliance, Torokat? Yeah! He's not. What do you mean? I've kept a bird's eye view on everyone. Foxy, Rod, and Kirby are in an alliance. Kirby's been pulling the strings. 
He's not in a true alliance with you. He's in another alliance. Huh? Wait, what? K Kirby! Ooh, a spark in the air. You'll love to see it. <laughs> bye, bye, yeah. bye, 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 bye. Kirby, I trusted you. Bye, yo. Kirby! <sighs> I'll see myself out. Thank you. Wait, what? There he goes, I guess. Cheerio, I suppose. Wow, he jumped at himself without me having to pull him over there. That's a first. Anyways, we now have 11 campers left. Or, should I say, flight passengers left. We have 11 passengers left and the merge is coming up soon. What will be the next challenge? I don't know. And, now that Ludwig is gone, uh, like the, whole, the brains is gone? That's one less enemy for Gaston to deal with. What's Gaston gonna do? He's been kinda in the shadows throughout this whole co past couple of episodes. Rod and Foxy and Kirby are now in alliance, and Turtle has just found out. Oh, I guess some drama's gonna go down. Tails is with Grinch, and, well, Beetlejuice is now alone. He said he's a lone wolf. What tricks will he pull? I'm not sure. He can shapeshift, so I don't know. Squash and Night Zombie are also still in alliance, and Cuphead is alone. What's he gonna do? I don't know. Find out all of this on the next episode of TDPE. Season 4.